Hey all my Scruff fans, welcome to a new episode of Fast Talk, the food show talk about new foods and other stuff. Uh, we are going to be finally talking about the Mountain Dew Frostbite. I finally was able to find it. Uh, you can get it at Walmart, it's only at Walmart. You, you can only get it in the, uh, the 16.9 ounce bottles. Um, you might be able to get it in the cans, I haven't seen the cans. But uh, yeah. One more flavor this is going to be, and I just noticed this, they put naturally flavored, or naturally and artificially flavored dew. So if not dew, rain from the sky, and condensates on the ground and is collected in the morning, apparently. This looks like, kind of like the Liberty Brew or the Live Wire. Ooh. I might do like a compilation of all me opening stuff at the end of the year. Okay, this smells just like the live wire. It's probably like a fruit punch. Got a little onion mug. My drugs. Jesus metal coffee. Okay. So it's just the, excuse me, it's Kool-Aid, it's fizzy Kool-Aid. Well, that's not bad though, but I have a feeling this is going to taste eerily similar to the, uh, to the Liberty Brew. That's not bad. I think they're really decent. I like the color. I wish it was like more frosty. Like, why isn't there a mint soda? I mean, there is. You go to like your local like grocery store that you can only get certain areas or like the fairy of mint sodas. But, like, why hasn't like a mainstream soda company done a mint soda? There probably is some in. Jap There's probably some in Japan. Which you could look at all my Japanese export reviews. Um, I have a playlist made. Um, well, is there one coming out soon? I think there is. I have like two shot and they're ready to go in a couple weeks. But yeah. That's not bad. It's not bad, but it's. It just tastes eerily similar to other of the uh, blue flavored Mountain Dews. I do love the bottle, though. It's light blue, the Mountain Dew logo with the white background, the white thing. And then, but you got a freaking street shark blasting out of the ice. That's freaking awesome. But yeah, it's it's not bad, but it could be better. It does have a wine punch taste to it. Um, I wish it was a little more of what the title was. Like, you could have just called it Hawaiian Punch. But I wonder if that was, like, a carburetor thing. It, 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 it shouldn't be. You just put Hawaiian Punch have like, a Ryu character. Or Mortal Kombat character tied into Mortal Kombat when the new game came out, when 11 came out. Or, is there another one? Is it 11 Aftermath or something? So, excuse me, something like that. But, um, excuse me, man. It's not bad. I drink it. It was just a little disappointing. You think you get another flavor. Um, but it's still decent. You know, you go get it at Walmart. You can check it out on Facebook, Twitter, or Instagram. At uh, social media or at Captain Scruffbeard. Links are in the description. 
and you all have a good rest of your day. Stay bearded, stay faithful, peace.